This is Rocket, one of the first animals ever at the Sedgwick County Zoo when it opened in the early 70s, bringing smiles to faces for decades. But nearly 40 years later, in 2009, the more than 500 pound tortoise realized how big he was and became an escape artist. Just to give you an idea how massive this guy is, take a look at this. If I curled up into a ball next to him, he would be at least two or three times my size. Now this is not something you want stepping on your toes. He actually attained a length that could span the length of the bars. He could get his legs over the edge of this and just walk right down. Nate Nelson was Rocket's handler back in 2009. He says when he would escape, it was impossible to lift him back up. So it would take hours to walk him all the way around and back up to his exhibit. That's when Nelson made the tough decision to send him off to a better home. It was difficult because he's uh, always been a zoo favorite here, both the keepers and the public, but uh, he was just too big for that indoor exhibit any longer. Nelson shipped Rocket off to Tulsa. That's where his new handler, Chris Williams, first met him, but it didn't last long. He had the same problem where he escaped there multiple times. So it was off to max security for the 90-year-old tortoise, a brand new state-of-the-art exhibit at the Bronx Zoo. But finally, more than a decade later, with an escape-proof area to live, Rocket is home. We did get to open a new giant tortoise exhibit for Galapagos tortoises, and it's much more secure here. Nelson says while he's pretty sure it's one-sided, He's glad he gets to spend every day again with one of his oldest friends. I don't think he recognizes me, um, but it's hard to say. You know, you can't, they don't really have any facial features.